news this morning on the search for a coronavirus vaccine. The results of one small study on humans are now in, and they appear to be encouraging. NBC News medical correspondent Dr. John Torres joins us with more on that. I love when I see the word encouraging in a script. Uh, just tell us what we can expect with this. And this is very encouraging. In a company called Moderna, in the sprint for the vaccine, they've taken a little bit of a lead here because in their phase one trial, they found out that for some of the participants, they don't have all the results yet, early results now, but in eight of the participants, they actually ended up seroconverting, we call it. So they basically found out that because of the vaccine, they had antibodies. The good part is those antibodies are neutralizing. In other words, they'll take care of coronavirus and prevent it from taking hold, safe and well tolerated. And they found out that they were getting levels equivalent to people who recover from coronavirus and now we think have some immunity to it. On a side note, they also did an earlier study or compared it to an earlier study of mice where they used the same vaccine and found out the, the mice actually were able to get, not get the coronavirus when they infected them with it purposefully. This is really, this is very encouraging news, but I think a lot of people when they hear like something's close with a vaccine that there's like a eureka moment, like, wow, we have a vaccine. Let's go ahead and put it out there. But that's not how this works, is it? Exactly. And this is good news because we're getting step forward in the vaccine process here, but they still have two more phases to go through. They'll do a phase two, which is about 600 people, and then they'll do the big phase three. They think they'll start that in July. That's the one that's going to give us a lot of answers. If they get through that, then we'll get the vaccine, keeping our fingers crossed, hopefully right. soon. And lastly, just if all those phases go properly, when does that mean a vaccine may come? So they're going to start the phase three in July. That's yeah. what they're hoping to. It just depends on how phase three pans out. That usually takes months or years. In this case, they're hoping months. And so again, I think that 12 to 18 month is probably something pretty expectant. And so we're talking sometime after the new year, I think is when we'll get it. Maybe before if things fall into place really well. Right. A lot of things have to work out for that to happen. All right, Dr. Torres, thanks for that note.